Howdy folks, Chad Patchkey with Ethos Process Safety Solutions. In this brief video, I want to share with you our most common finding when we are auditing or assessing relief system mechanical integrity programs. So if this is something you're interested in, stick around and I'll give you the details. So when we go out and we either as part of a compliance audit or we're doing just a mechanical integrity specific gap assessment, when we look at relief systems, we compare the company and the site practices to the applicable RAGA gaps. And the key applicable RAGA gap for a relief valve inspection, testing, and maintenance is API recommended practice 576. So we look at the should and shall expectations in that guidance document when we're auditing or assessing an owner user. The most common finding that we have when we look at these programs deals with on-stream visual inspections. There's an expectation in the frequency of performing those inspections that not many owner users know about. It's in section 9.2.5. The title of that section is Frequency of Visual On-Stream Inspections, and it's the second paragraph. And that paragraph reads, after maintenance of the valves is completed, a full visual on-stream inspection shall be performed before startup. This provides a critical check that the proper relief device is in the proper location, installed properly, and has the proper set pressure for the intended service. What this section is referring to is uh, another section, 8.1, which describes a 17-point inspection as the visual on-stream inspection. You should do that periodically while the relief valve is in service, but it is a shall, which is a rag gap expectation in API RP 576 to do that 17-point inspection after maintenance but before commissioning when you reinstall that relief app. Now not all 17 points will apply in every application but it is an expectation in that document to do that. And if you're wondering about RAGA gaps and shall and should statements, I have another video out there that I'll provide a link to in the description and if I can figure it out there may be a link up here somewhere that you can click on. That's our most common finding when we go out there and do these audits and, and assessments, and I hope you found this useful.